It's Mama Sue here. Today I'm going to show you a recipe that I did many months ago and it went viral. Everybody that tried it said it's the best. And it's cinnamon rolls made from the Hawaiian rolls. Y'all, don't ever think that these are not worth trying because they are delicious. Now I'm going to spray my pan, my 9 by 13 inch dish. You could put butter, but this works just as, as well. Now, I'm going to take these and I'm going to cut them right down the middle. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this or not. I hope you can. Okay, just cut them right down the middle and I'll come around on the other side. That's my ingredients. Angela has had these and she loved them. But when I asked the other day what's the favorite recipe, or I think Angela and Melissa asked, I had several that said these 12 minute cinnamon rolls. Okay. Now, I have, I'm going to put the bottom half on here. Okay. I'll save this and let's mix up the goodness. One stick of butter softened and you want it soft because you're going to be mashing it down. And then you're going to take one fourth cup of brown sugar and one tablespoon of cinnamon. If I put a little bit more, that's okay. You want, you do want the tablespoon though. Okay. Now, I'm just gonna make sure that this is all mixed together the brown sugar, and the cinnamon, and the butter. Okay, it's coming together. Okay. Now, I'm going to get a, just a butter knife out, and we're going to spread half of it, half of this, on the bottom. Now this is so much easier. I have made homemade, homemade cinnamon rolls before. And you have to let your bread rise and, you know, they're delicious, but they take so long. How's the weather where you are? It is freezing in Alabama. Freezing. For several days we've had cold, cold weather. And we're not used to it here. You may, I know I shouldn't complain because some of you have it cold all the time. All right, now you're going to take your other half and you're going to turn those on top just like that, and we're going to put the rest of this on top. I'm going to just kind of spread it about, and I have, I'm going to cook these, I think it's, it's 12 minutes, that's why they're called 12 minute cinnamon rolls, on 350 degrees, and then we're going to frost them. And oh my goodness, it's going to be so good. See, this is all you do. You just... I want you to try this and let me know what you think about it. Because everybody that has tried it has said, I can't believe how good these are and how much they taste just like you had cooked them all the time. Now, I'm going to make sure I get all this. 
Now I'll put these in the oven and I'll be back when they come out. Okay, these cooked exactly 12 minutes. And you see how that melted kind of on top? Well, now we're gonna put the goodness. This is three cups of powdered sugar. And we're gonna put six to seven tablespoons of heavy whipping cream. One, two, three, four, five, and we're gonna start with six. We may have to add a little more. I am gonna use this whisk right here. Yep, gonna have to put a little bit more. Because we want it to be able to, you know, put the dollops. I don't know if that's a word or not. Dollop. Okay, let me go ahead and add another. Now this is a lot of, of the frosting. Okay, these are still a little warm. So let me get a, a knife and I'll put these on here and just kind of spread it. And that cinnamony goodness. Oh my. You're going to be shocked if you haven't tried this at how much these taste like a homemade cinnamon roll. Let me just put this on here and let it, let the heat melt a little bit. See, if you let that heat get to it a little bit. You know, sometimes people want them just perfectly beautiful. I want them perfectly delicious. Okay, let me get a plate, and I'm going to put one here. Mm. Oh my goodness gracious, alive. Let me get my fork. just like I remembered it. Mm. Go today. Get you some Hawaiian rolls and try this. Delicious. Y'all remember to be salt and light, and I'll be back soon.